Scientists have found an extraterrestrial meteorite with hexagonal diamond crystals. Before they found them in four meteorites in northwestern Africa, scientists didn't believe they existed. Despite hexagonal rather than cubic atom arrangements, their chemical composition is carbon. Because these crystals were so tiny, it was challenging to determine whether they were hexagonal diamonds. Using an electron microscope, they examined 18 meteorite samples for bigger crystals. They found four African meteorites to contain hexagonal diamonds, some of which were up to a micrometer in size, or 1,000 times larger than known crystals. The discovery of Lonsdaleite, a rare hexagonal form of diamond that may be more durable than regular diamonds, in uraelite meteorites that were formed in the mantle of a far-off dwarf planet, was made by the researchers. About 4.5 billion years ago, a huge asteroid and the dwarf planet may have collided, creating the Lonsdaleite. The difference between hexagonal diamonds and regular diamonds lies in their crystal structure. Here are some key differences. Hexagonal diamonds have carbon atoms arranged into a hexagonal pattern, while regular diamonds have carbon atoms arranged into a cubic pattern. Hexagonal diamonds are formed when graphite is exposed to extreme heat and stress, such as at meteor impact sites, while regular diamonds are formed deep within the Earth's mantle under high pressure and temperature. It has long been assumed that hexagonal diamonds in impact craters are stronger than cubic diamonds due to impurities inside, but they've never been measured reliably. The synthetic hexagonal diamonds, on the other hand, are stiffer and stronger than the natural gem diamonds. Hexagonal diamond is a term that is used to describe Lonsdaleite, a rare hexagonal form of diamond that may be stronger than regular diamonds. Like most diamonds, carbon is the only component, but the crystals are in the shape of a hexagon. Hexagonal diamonds have a unique geometric shape with six sides, while we can cut regular diamonds into a variety of shapes. Hexagonal diamonds differ from conventional diamonds in terms of their crystal structure and possess certain qualities that make them interesting to scientists. The discovery of hexagonal diamonds in meteorites is significant for several reasons. Diamonds found in these meteorites were produced by intense shock pressures acting on crystalline graphite inclusions already present in the meteorite before impact, as opposed to disintegrating of larger, statically grown diamonds, as some theories propose, according to the discovery of hexagonal diamonds in meteorites. The discovery of larger hexagonal diamonds in meteorites allows researchers to get a better idea of how they formed and maybe replicate that process in the lab. The unusual hexagonal type of diamond, known as Lonsdaleite, which was found in uralite meteorites that were produced in the mantle of a distant dwarf planet, may have developed because of the collision of the dwarf planet with a huge asteroid some 4.5 billion years ago. The discovery of hexagonal diamonds in meteorites provides insight into the formation and evolution of the solar system and the processes that occur on other planets and asteroids. The unusual hexagonal type of diamond known as Lonsdaleite, which was found in uralite meteorites that were produced in the mantle of a distant dwarf planet, may have developed because of the collision of the dwarf planet with a huge asteroid some 4.5 billion years ago. I think these videos are brilliant, and I'm sure you will like them too. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to click the notification bell.